Glue and pin a row of strips 3 mm above the highest whale already fitted. The, cap, the gap can be reduced to 2 mm if your whales are fitted higher than in the photos shown in your instructions. The moulding should fall in the middle of the gap between the upper whale and the bulwark cap. Carefully pull out or cut off the pins when the glue is completely dry. Hold the cast side supports and roof of the canopy in place to check the fit. You may need to file the tops of the supports to match the angle of the roof. Attach the supports to the hull planking using super glue. When fitting the side ladders, mark the edges of the steps using masking tape, using the picture in your instructions and the notes as a guide. Now lightly sand the back of the wriggles to help them to stick, then glue them in place with super glue.
When fitting the fenders, use a strip of wood to mark two vertical lines for the fenders near the ladders. Put them 9mm apart centrally between the top and the middle gun ports. Cut 2 by 2 mm strips to fit between the whales and mouldings. Bend two more lengths of 2x2mm two two wood to match the curve of the hull and extend about 2.5mm above the bulwark. Sand the radius on the bottom ends then glue these strips into place. Fit two short strips of 2x2mm two two wood on top of the bulwark. When the glue is dry, sand the tops of the vertical strips flush and sand a radius on the end. Check the position of the shorter fender in the picture in step 7. It runs between the upper and middle gun ports, ending halfway down the middle port. Glue pieces of 1x3mm wood between the wells and mouldings. Complete the fender with a strip of 2x3mm wood bent to the curb of the hull. You may need to cut a recess over the riggle. Stain if required and sand the radius on both ends.